Hi friends, welcome back to Live Before You Die channel. My name is Vipul and today I'm going to talk about a real life lesson which I experienced few minutes ago. So without much ado, let's dive into the video. So the first life lesson I'm going to talk about today is repeat the dose until the patient dies. You see, I'm a big fan of trekking and I find myself in jungles every weekend. And there was a wall, there's a, in fact there's a wall in this jungle which I always thought about climbing but I was not able to climb. Maybe I was not having enough strength or I was not having enough will to climb this wall. So I was just trying to climb this wall from past two or three weeks but I was unable to do so. And today finally I achieved it, I was able to climb it. And you must have seen that, you know, I have been, I have done numerous failed attempts to climb this wall. But finally, I achieved it. So what I learned from this achievement is, try and try again until you succeed. If you are persistent, if you are consistent, then there is nothing in this world that you cannot achieve. However, this achievement is not the reason for making this video and not this life lesson. The next life lesson is more important life lesson which I'm going to talk about and which is never compare yourself with others. So many of you would be thinking, right, Vipul, you have just climbed a 10 feet wall. What's the big deal? I mean, you are behaving like, you know, you have climbed Mount Everest or you are behaving like you have climbed Great Wall of China or you are behaving like, you know, you have won an Olympic medal or you have run uh, won a marathon. No, agreed. I have not done anything like that, right? This is something which is a very small achievement. However, I would like to talk about a real life story about not comparing yourself with others. So what happened around 25 to 30 years back when Shah Rukh Khan, the king of Bollywood, was working in a serial called Fauji, right? And Navjot Singh Sidhu, the famous cricketer and politician and comedian, met him and he asked Shah Rukh Khan, Shah Rukh Khan, you are doing a great job. And what are your next plans? So Shah Rukh Khan replied, I'm going to break the Bollywood and I'm going to become the king of Bollywood. And to which Sidhu laughed. Navjot Singh Sidhu said, Bollywood is full of cutthroat competition and Bollywood guys would eat you like a hot sausage for breakfast. To which Shah Rukh Khan replied, I don't compare myself with anybody else. I compare myself with myself so same thing i'm going to talk about today is we should not compare ourselves with others so for example if i compare my achievement to the achievement of an olympic medaler or somebody who has climbed mount everest all i'm going to get is dissatisfaction and frustration however if i compare myself with my previous week achievements i would definitely see that of course i have done a great deal i was looking at this wall like you know like this wall is unconquerable and today I'm sitting on the top of this wall and conquering this wall. So whenever we are comparing ourselves to our previous achievement, it will always give a sense of happiness, feeling of achievement and feeling of fulfillment. <clears throat> and the third life lesson, which is the most important one, is never put the key of your happiness in someone else's pocket. What does that mean? You know, we all know that we have done a great amount of achievement in the past but we only become happy when someone appreciates it, when somebody claps about it, when somebody give, tells us good things about our achievement. So what happens when nobody talks about it and nobody appreciates us about it? We have a tendency to get into a self-doubt. We think ourselves as worthless or we think of ourselves that you know we are not good for anything. But inside we know that we have done a great job. So the life lesson here is that if you know that you have achieved something big, if you know from inside that you have done something marvelous, even if nobody is appreciating you, even if nobody is saying good about you, even if nobody is acknowledging it, you should feel proud of yourself. You should pat yourself in the back and you should always appreciate yourself for that achievement. Because otherwise, if you don't do that, nobody else is going to do it for you. So always pat your back. 
always make yourself feel good for the small achievements your happiness or your achievements should not be dependent on what other people think about your happiness or achievement it should only be dependent on how you think about yourself after achieving that goal so let me end this video with a question when was the last time you appreciated yourself when was the last time you patted yourself in back think about it and give your feedback in the comment section below thank you for watching this is vipul signing off till we meet again